during the International Maritime Defense Industry Exhibition 2021 or Modex 2021, two South Korean defense companies, Lignex-1 and Hanwha Systems unveils at two competing models of the close-in weapon systems each of them is proposing to meet the Republic of Korea Navy SeaWiz-2 requirement. Under the SeaWiz-2 program the Republic of Korea Navy's aims to acquire a locally developed SeaWiz for use on its future warships, including the service's light aircraft carrier, KDDX guided missile destroyers, and FFX-3 class guided missile frigates. South Korea is aiming to completely develop the system by December 2030 for about 320 billion South Korean won or about $287 million, with Seoul formally opening the bidding process for the project last May. The Lignex-1 Close and Weapon Systems proposed design features a 30mm Gatling type gun that is capable of firing 4,200 rounds per minute, a tracking active electronically scanned array radar, a non-rotating, four-faced ESA search radar, and an electro-optical targeting system. While the radars will be locally designed and built, the weapon is not likely to be a locally developed one but rather the same GAO 8-A Avenger 7-barreled autocannon used by the goalkeeper SeaWiz, which is already in service with the Ro KN. Meanwhile, the Hanwha system's close-in weapon system's proposed design is stealthier but with similar radar and EOTS features. It seems the Hanwha design would also employ the same GAO 8-A Avenger 7-barreled autocannon. There's a big possibility that these firms will team up with foreign companies, such as Thales or Raytheon, to secure the development contract. With this development it is highly possible that Philippine Navy will acquire this system in the near future, due to close defense cooperation between the Philippines and South Korea.